Good morning, everyone. It's Friday. Um, I'm just getting up here to Christiansburg and helping my parents. They are dropping their vehicle off for an inspection, tire rotation, all that jazz. And they actually have to drop it off. It takes a few hours, so I figured I would follow them up here let them hop in the car with me and then while we're up here we will go to the mall and kind of shop around and stuff and just make a day of it. The cool thing about the Christiansburg Blacksburg area is that Virginia Tech College is located here and so um, there is plenty to do so we should be able to keep ourselves busy until the car is ready. Oh yeah, I do too. And I've left the tag on because, you know, I've noticed that a lot of younger people are leaving their tags on stuff, like when they're wearing their clothes or their shoes or their hats even. So I figured, I'm young and trendy, I'm just gonna leave mine on too. Not really. <laughs> I think it's like, a, it's the tag, but I can't get it off without scissors and I have no scissors and I really wanted these glasses like now because I needed to wear them on my way home because I forgot my sunglasses. I've got a billion cheap sunglasses, but I have none of them in the van. So anyway, um, we are back at my parents' house. I'm just waiting on them to get here. They took the old people route 
back home. Um, they took the scenic route through town as where I took the interstate. So I'm probably gonna be sitting here for probably a good five, 10 minutes. But that's okay. to my parents house and mowed their grass for them while I was there because the storms here have been like hit or miss lately and so I figured if I didn't do it then it might not get done before I leave for vacation and so I've got Ryan here with me and she's playing in her little water I don't know what it's called a water table and she is soaking wet now she just dumped water all over herself but she's having fun and that's all that matters I only have Ryan with me today. Carter is staying the night with my mom and um, gonna spend some time with them since we're gonna be gone all next week. So uh, that's okay. Me and Ryan can have some girly time. My mother-in-law is coming over as well to stay the night, I believe. Hey. Yucky. Bad I know, it's yucky. Is it brown? No, no. Yucky. I say boom, boom, boom. It's all done. Hello. Say hot, hot, hot. Hello. Hello. <laughs> you want me to turn it back on? 
Then bring it here. Uh oh. Let me turn it back on for you. Who's on the phone? Is it Nana? Did you break it? Where are you going? Bye bye. Sweet girls night. Watching some Elmo. I like this view. You just hanging out with Dada? Checking out the new DVD player. Mm -hmm. I know nothing exciting on it at the moment. Hang on. <laughs> oh, goodness. Hey, look. <gasps> What's she playing? She's getting ready to come up. It's pretty nice. Pretty colors. <laughs> Tinkerbell. You'll learn about Tinkerbell. Oops, ran out first. You're silly. This morning we went and picked up Carter from my mom's house and um, my mom decided she wanted to keep Ryan overnight. So we have Carter for the day. We're gonna spend um, the day with him and just kind of hang out. I've got a lot of stuff to do today in order to pack for vacation and um, just get things cleaned up because tomorrow is pretty busy. We have a couple events that we need to go to and so I won't have a lot of time tomorrow to pack up. Um, Carter is outside playing with uh, Mimi and his daddy in the water ta on the water table and he is loving it. Um, that kid just loves water. So while they are out there playing, I need to tackle our bedroom and get our clothes situated and washed and give you a quick preview real quick because it is a hot mess in here. Ta-da! It's taking me all freaking day to do this, but it's done. So now all I gotta do is start packing for our trip. Is it good? Are you happy now? You were hangry earlier. He was all calm until I came in here. Good grief.
You out of breath? You put the hat on? Good job. <laughs> Packing for the kids can be very stressful at times, but I think I'm kind of getting the hang of it. I tend to just not really know where to start, but since I made my list of things I needed to pack for our last vacation I just kind of am going off of that and if I need something extra I added it and if I don't need something then that's even better but um, one of the things I'm trying to do is to downsize of how many bags we take like I don't mind taking um, you know a few larger bags or suitcases but I don't want to be taking a lot of little bags with just things in them because that's just a lot of things that you have to unpack and then repack so what I'm trying this route is um, I've actually got the kids their own suitcase and I'm putting like their bedding for their pack and plays in here, um, our swimming towels, I'll be putting their clothes in here and shoes, socks, anything you know that I could fit in here of theirs, maybe even um, their toiletry or um, safety kit items might go in there. And then, you know, I'm hoping I can fit other things in there as well because their clothes really don't take up too much space. I try not to overpack with the kids' uh, clothes especially, but we don't really have a washing machine or access to one that I know of anyway. And so I want to make sure that they have at least one to two outfits each day only because if, if they have an accident or something, they need a, a change out clothes. You know, things happen. Then I'm going to have a suitcase for my stuff, which typically I could fit in my um, clothes and my toiletry stuff. And then my husband will have his bag. I usually take a small tote and I put miscellaneous stuff in it, like their diapers, their wipes. I also will put like, we have a pump for their swimming um, floats that we've we're going to be using this week. I also have a tote in here that I usually put like oatmeal and snacks and maybe some of those uh, pouches that they eat from and also have to put their bottles and then I'll have like sunblock and their baby monitors. Also I'll have to put the noise machine in there because they have to have their noise machine. I do have that tote that I just put miscellaneous stuff in um, and then we have this little um, bag of pool stuff which includes their life jackets, their floats are on the bottom, their swimming diapers, um, and just anything else that I need to put in there miscellaneous wise. Hey everyone, I am just going to go ahead and end the vlog. I am so exhausted from today but so excited for vacation. I hope everyone had a great day. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, and we will see you in our next video. Bye, guys.